Okay, there we go. Now let's see if it'll let me run an ad. There we go. Try and get that out of the way right quick. Alright, so we got... So we got seeding going on. It's almost about a little more than halfway done. Let's see, cows. What's up, Jetta? So we need grass. We need grass. No, by all means, this is for you. Yeah, so, so, uh, so he's got a, he's got some, he's got some explaining to do, some fixing. already holy crap what's up wolf all right oh my goodness I know all right they're off let's see what we can figure out here Let's see, that'll put it down. That should start it, and that should lower it. Let's see. See if this works. All right, let's see here. Yes, sir. I already did. <laughs> okay.
Yeah. We were going to, but then we want to get the money, and then we're just going to take the next harvest and do nothing but oats. Well, you can buy oats. Yeah. It's not too expensive. So I figure we'll do the money grab first, because then you'll be able to get more horses instead of... You know, just just grab a bunch of oats, and then after this harvest, then we'll set everything for um, oat. This way you'll have plenty of oat, and then you're pretty much good to go on that end. You know what I mean? I don't know, dude. I'm trying, trying to get something here. All right. What? What's not down? Yeah, I don't know if I believe you there, brother, because you always got something to say. Although it is moving kind of fast. serious oh. so let's see so usually the B button let's see if that's all right it's going slower so that has to be working all right cool <clears throat> Yeah, well, he don't he don't steer me wrong. goodness uh, let's take a look at what we got here just chilling <coughs> what's up missus I don't have any water so I can't hydrate uh oh dude I don't have access oh my own I just spent like three minutes mowing absolutely nothing <laughs> oh my god Jesus Christ. Uh. What's that, Jinx? Um. Let me see. Oh, my. Rabbit Wolf was up again, brother. Um, let's see. I'm just waiting for this save thing to do its thing. So the road 
so in front of the farm. Oh, that road that leads down to the main road? Is it ours? Uh, it is not as of right now. It costs 40 grand to buy it. Why, what you thinking? Wait, what do you mean? Click on what we own. Okay, no worries. No worries. <clears throat> we own land next to the barn. Okay. Let me see where you're at. Oh, over there. You're 24. I got you. All right, <clears throat> well, I'll go and collect this, and then we'll maybe head over that way. See how much we get out of this one. Turn on. There we go. Alright, let's collect this. Oh, my. Oh. So I wonder how they're going to do the aircraft carriers, Jinx. Like, are they just going to drop them in, you know, the line and you... Oh, you think one... Really? Interesting. Okay. What, baby? 
Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Right. Okay. Yeah, there is, babe. I got it. I need water, though. My container is empty. Was there any other ones other than that? Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, there are. When Dragon gets back, he said he'll try and download the mods that we have on here. He's got like six maps downloaded. <laughs> yeah. I was like, holy crap. I don't know. I think the most I've ever had at one time was... Three. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> DJ. <laughs> Come here. Good thing you didn't say women. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would have been uh that would have been something. You'd have been calling Zizi up saying Where's the address? <laughs> Hopefully that's a duplex on that doghouse. <laughs> So you guys doing anything tomorrow night after work at the new joint? You're going to be moving some stuff or you wait until Saturday? Is that everything on this strip? I feel like I missed some stuff. Goodness. Yeah, like after work, do you have a lot of... Thanks, bro. You're welcome. Do you have a lot of stuff you guys are going to do tomorrow? Yeah. Oh, yeah.
He just burns everything and starts over. <laughs> Yeah. Where's the trigger? Oh, here we go. So, we got about 13 grand there. All right, cool. Nice. That's cool. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Oh, this cat's out of seed. Oh, this um, this one cedar. This one right here. Yep. Yep.
So why does this guy still work for you, guys? And nothing happened to you? So he gets in trouble? Right. He... Wow. And he can't... He can't press no, no charge on you? Right, but was he showing harm against you? Right, and then smashed it on the table. Wow. Holy crap. Jesus. <coughs> Yeah, no, I'm, I mean, I'm just surprised that something like that doesn't, like, doesn't have to go before HR and looked into because, you know, like, oh, so they're, Well, yeah, 
I, I'm I'm playing devil's advocate here. I'm just trying to think like, if I'm that dude, okay, if I do anything to any equipment, yeah, my ass is probably going to get fired. But in no way, shape, or form did I think somebody was going to just haul off and knock my ass out. Like I I like I'd be I'd be honest to God I'd be in the lawyer's office right now, and I'd be suing the damn company. I'd be like, yo, that this this cat had no no right you know, taking a swing at me. Nowhere in my contract or in my employment does it say that a fellow coworker is going to knock me out when, you know, like I didn't draw a weapon. I did, I did, you know, hit a monitor. So obviously my intent was I'm, I'm getting ticked off at equipment at no point did I raise my hand, you know, like if I'm him, I'm like coming after everybody, you know what I mean? Like, holy crap. I'm, yeah, but the, right. But what I'm saying is, so it was identified that he smashed the keyboard on the table. So I posed no threat where somebody needed to take a swing at me. Well, yeah, but what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, well, but it's intent to do harm. So it's just like the discussions that we always have with you know, a youth going into his waistband when the cop says, put your hands up, right? So you guessed that he was going to do harm to you, but you didn't know for sure. And obviously it turned out that he wasn't trying to do you harm. So in all actuality, if you're looking at it the way other people look at these other situations, he didn't do anything wrong other than smash equipment, which should be directed to HR and they, you know, they take care of business with him. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I'm him, that's what I'm saying. It, right. Right, but, but, well, yeah, but that, yeah, but that's a different, like, that's a different part. Like, if he's showing you aggression, it's one thing. Like, if he walked up to the desk and he goes over and he shoves you and he's like, yeah, what are you looking at? And you're like, yo, what's your problem? And he grabs you and pushes you and then turns and grabs a keyboard. You know, now, yeah, like, you know, he, right. Wow, that's so weird. DJ, the stream wants to hear this, okay? Yeah. Well, wow, that's crazy. That'd have been funny. Oh, my. Hey, team. Hydrate. Hmm. I think you should have tickled them. I got the hydrate, baby. Thank you. 
I'd have tickled them and then smash them with the monitor. <laughs> I'm racking. I'm just, I'm just racking up my points. <clears throat> hmm. It was just a byproduct. Yeah. Right, right. <laughs> right. You gotta give him st put that yeah they need to they need the uh, they need to put the gun down and give him a tie stick what's up there Vulcan Yeah. Yep. Right. Right. So you could stop somebody. Well, no, because the way they look at it over this way is they could have something you don't know about and it's better to incapacitate them and then figure it out later. That's pretty much, that's how, that's, that's, that's like, well, yeah, I mean, so that's, that's always been the big arguments with everything that's been going on. Like there's, you know, there's cases, they have videos where, you know, cops are telling a person, put your hands up and step out of the car. They step out of the car and they start putting their hand in their waistband. Dude gets shot. And here in his waistband, he had a hero sandwich. Right? He had a silver foil wrapped hoagie and got shot. Right? So everybody's, you know, everybody who's got an opinion on it is pointing fingers where they think you know, fingers should be pointed. The problem is, you know, you live in a country that's going to allow weapons anywhere. I mean, let's let's be real. I know they have contingencies and license, and but there's people out there that can have guns that don't have shit. <laughs> so, it, if your country's going to have guns, what's going to happen is, yeah, exactly. What's going to happen is people are going to feel every motion is a potential threat of a weapon so you know at that point you know it it, it becomes you know hyper yeah and the problem is everybody fights saying you know well you know this person's intent was to how do you know you can't speak on anybody's intent 
you know, based on a video. You know, there's people that go, oh, well, you can't really tell reading lips. You can read lips better in a video than tell somebody's intent just on face value. Now, for me, it's only my opinion. If a police officer tells you don't move, you don't move. It's that simple. If you make any movement whatsoever, because if this was the Old West, if you make that same movement and that dude's not a cop, the same result's going to happen. So, you know, even if you're having a, uh, a, a, a fist fight, if a person flinches, that other person's going to either flinch, like, away, or is going to flinch and take a poke at you. Oh, here you go. You grab that one. Oh. All right, so let's see. We got, um... Oh, wait. He wants to clean it, Jinx. He wants to clean it. <laughs> he wants... <laughs> He wants to clean that sucker. Here, let me dirty this one for you. <laughs> Wait, do we have to... Do we have to, um... Do I, do I have to fertilize the other field? I think that... I forget if I gotta, fer, if I gotta fertilize the other track field or not. Let's see... Oh, wait, I think actually it would have been better for me to go to the map. So what do we got? We got Crystal and Ultara. We have Crystal and Ultara sitting over there in the... Uh... Dominica just, I mean, DJ just viciously smacked Dominica in the back with two packs of ramen. <laughs> Why did he do that? Because she was like... What? <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> Interesting. Yes. So he hit my kid, huh? Yes. Oh, okay. Full grown adult kid. Well, I'll tell him when he goes home tonight he better kiss his father and his brother good night because it'll be the last night he sees them. Papa, the chat's quiet today. Yes, tell it is a little quiet. Tell him to start talking. Yeah. <laughs> it is a little quiet. There goes Jumpin' Jetta. I know, he jumps all the time. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to. He's trying to get a dirty tractor. Trying to dirty this one up. They're already done for the day. Buy a couple more. You said what are they like? Five grand. Yeah, buy two more. Oh, gotcha. Oh no, why is it gonna be someone's last night? Oh, <laughs> what's up, Wolf?
Oh my. Uh, no. So, so you can't drop a, uh, they don't have any straw bales? Can you just... It has to be straw pellets? No, it can be, so you can feed them oat or hay or hay pellets. Yeah, it just says straw. So you could just drop a straw bale in there. Ling and I, let's say. <laughs> <clears throat> Wolf. 
All right, hydrate. Kiss Mrs. Crew. Oh, let me go over. Oh my goodness. Oh. I want to hear the. Hello, hello. Oh. Oh man. All right, Wolf. I'm gonna have to get you on that when we do the uh, when we do the harvest and whatnot. I'm oh. taller than you, Papa. This is true. Yo, I'm gonna hit the head. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, what do we got here? I am. Nope, it's just making me jump. There we go. All right, let's take a look at field. Still not done yet. Yep. And we got a little bit left. Well, yeah, I can I can dump a straw bale in there. Just making sure I'm not the only one. Gotcha. Yeah, no problem, Wolf. Oh, it doesn't it doesn't let you use caps, Wolf? Oh, that's weird. Okay. That's weird.
What are you doing, TJ? What are you doing? Nothing. Oh. Mom said, what did I do this time? Oh, okay. <laughs> I saw you, like, creeping in. I'm like, what the hell did you do this time? <laughs> oh, but I, I gotta head out. Alright, brother. Be good. Have fun. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow. You don't have to worry about picking up. Gotcha. What's that? Nice. Yeah. That's good stuff. All right, there, Wolf. Let me take the spectacles off here. All right, let's back up and let's see. Let's see what we can do here. Just gonna put our headland on here. Um, not sure just yet, actually. All right, let's see here. Yeah, it might be like 40s, 50s, maybe. I think over the weekend I might modify some of the channel point things here to make it even a little more interesting. We'll have to stay tuned. Alright, let's see. Let's go. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, did I? Oh, I missed that whole row right there, didn't I? Holy mackerel. Did I miss? Man, it looks like I missed something right here. Should we get it? Oh.
Mm -hmm. What's that, baby? Oh no, I'm good. Thank you. Appreciate it. Can you um just do me a favor? Grab me two peppermint patties, please. Those little guys. All right. Good. Talking to me? Oh, uh, hold on. What's that? Uh, I will as soon as I get to the end here. Thanks for okay. The missus is back. He's out. He's oh, he's knocked out already. All right, I got him with the glasses. <laughs> nice, I can see that. Yeah, for sure. Well, it is pretty obvious once that happens. Um, no, oh, what's this? Oh, did he step out? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> All right, so go over to animals. Go down to Altara. All right, so Altara has just is a all black horse. Let's go. Oh, I have Altera right here as black. Yes. Yep. <laughs> Like, if you look at my stream, you'll see it's all black. <laughs> Why? What? What is it showing for you? Yeah, and then here's the other one, which matches. <clears throat> so on your... On your screen, it's a different color. So how'd we do here? Oh, we did uh, pretty awful. Uh, hold on. That's pretty funny. Let's see. Tachimante. Oh, so it's showing them, it's showing them both the same color. Nice. That's good. That was fork, baby. That's interesting. Yeah. Yeah. And then she turned back to normal color. So they're probably mood horses. <laughs> yeah. It's like a mood ring. You sit on that sucker. It's going to tell us what you're feeling. 
<laughs> yeah. Nice. That's funny because usually when I ride them, they're satisfied. But yeah, that's a different story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah. That wouldn't be good. It'd be pretty dangerous. Oh, yeah. Yeah, don't make me Winnie all the way home. Uh, well, yeah, a little bit to clean up here. It wasn't as bad. So we got, uh... Could have been better, but... Nothing wrong with crooked. No. They do have on the PC. I don't know if they have it on the on here yet, where you can actually uh, breed now. Yep. Holy macro. Oh, cool. No. How about them apples? It's his maiden voyage. This is where you get the points. I used to still over at the church, babe. Oh, cool. Staying there longer than he thought he would. Oh, that was me. <laughs> you know, just just doing my thing. <laughs> I even wanted to go long ways and that didn't happen either. Jeez. I'm in 97% there, Jinx. What's happening, everybody, in the stream there? Hope you guys are having an awesome, awesome Thursday. Got one more day, and then it's the weekend. Oh, yeah? Come on. Oh, yeah? What's the holiday? You say Patico Day? Cool. Yeah. 
Okay. Very cool. Nice. It's a three-day weekend for you. That's awesome. Nice. Yeah. Not tomorrow. Good deal. My baby. <laughs> yeah, they don't want you to live lives out here. Double, double shift. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, those are, uh, that's what, that's what companies do over here anymore. So think about, think about what Jetta said, though. So two people couldn't show up for work. So he had to cover their shifts. So they're, they're at home doing what they need to do. But Jetta, but Jetta couldn't go home and did what he wanted to do. Right. Yeah. That's the way it should be, right? Yeah. Yeah. They don't do that shit no more. No, they just fire you. Oh, yeah, they'll just the guy who didn't get fired will take it and he'll work a double. Yep. <clears throat> now, all the stuff that goes on could stop tomorrow if ever you get all the workers out in the workforce to just stop.
but it'll never happen. They take advantage of... I remember I worked... I remember I worked um, in a print shop. And uh, there was this guy uh, who was our head press operator. And um, he was uh, the boss come over to him. So in the room that the head press operator worked in, he had two printing presses. One was usually set up for like envelopes and then the big one was set up for all the big runs that we did for uh, menus and magazines and what have you. So I'm out at my press and I was an apprentice at this time. And uh, manager goes up to the, manager goes up to the, to the print, the head press operator He's talking. I can't really make out what they're saying. It's kind of like semi-private conversation. So here the boss leaves, and I go over to him. I'm like, yo, is everything good? He's like, you believe what this son of a bitch had to go and ask me to do? I'm like, what? He's like, he asked me, you got that press running. Everything's going real good. Why is that one not running? And he's like, because I don't run that press until I'm done running this job. He's like, yeah, but there's two presses. You can run two presses at one time. He's like, you pay me two salaries, I'll run two presses at one time. <laughs> he said, so the boss looked at him, he's like, you run that goddamn press or I'll get rid of you. He said, well, then you might as well just get rid of me. <laughs> he said, because I ain't, I ain't doing the job of two people and getting paid for one. <laughs> And, uh, you know, he wound up, he didn't get fired, and he never ran two presses, but, oh, it was just the funniest thing. Yeah, of course. They got you, they, you're, you're trapped. Almost, I'd say, I'd say 80% of the, the jobs out there, they, they, they got everybody trapped. That's the way they want it. Yeah. Yeah, the problem is that you know, the workforce is now they their profit margins and things that they get or don't get. Um who am I running with? I'm running with Jinx and Jetta, baby. Um they have it where, see, back in the old days, that security company would have at least three people running a shift or four. So if somebody called out, it didn't matter, right? Now, they may run that shift with one or two people.
What's what was the name of him again? Gotcha. <clears throat> Are they nationwide or just in college? Hey, what's up, Ghost? So you... You ever work for Allied? Wait. Spectre Guard? Oh no, Spectre Guard's out your way. Yeah, that's the other thing. The only way you get <laughs> more pay is when you leave. All the print shops I worked at, I would get like very small raises. I would get a big jump when I moved to another company. It's like, wow, I give you guys eight years and you give me like a buck more an hour. And I can start for this company over here and they're going to start me at $4 more an hour just to go there. Yeah, I'm sure the price structures are completely different. Yeah. Like, I'm sure your, where you live doesn't cost you a thousand U.S. dollars a month. one-bedroom apartment <laughs> Jinx is going to sever all ties to the US <laughs> family no family you don't care <laughs> you'd have a mansion and kids and kids if you want them there you don't even have to have your own they'll just throw them in Yeah, you'd be living in a mansion in Aruba. Dude, I've actually watched some of those shows where they build these mansions in other countries and stuff. Yeah, for that much money, you could almost have a mansion in some of these islands. Unload. 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 Yeah, it's outrageous.
Yep. It's outrageous. <laughs> that doesn't even get you Trump's basement. <laughs> <laughs> That's like one dinner. Jeez. <clears throat> well, you could... Well, it so it depends. You know, it depends on where you buy. It depends... Um, like for me, right? My mortgage is only like 600 bucks. And my taxes are about 650 a month. So I have a house and I'm still paying less than what Jetta pays. Right. Right. Everything's relative. You know, if you buy a house, you know, depending on the neighborhood, like this same house that I'm in, if you were to get this house in like the state of Delaware, it probably only costs you like 400 bucks a month. Yeah. And then you have, you know, you have towns, there's like, like my old town, my old city where I lived in Philly, my taxes for the year were only $600 for the whole year. But, you know, it's a uh, beat down, run down, crime, drugs, and people are getting shot in the streets. <laughs> Nope, because Mrs. Crew. Oh, I'm on it. Yeah, it's, you know, it's, um, it all depends on where, it depends on how big the house is you're getting, how many bedrooms, the neighborhood. Pucker up, Mrs. Crew. Oh. Like, there's a town that's right next to us uh, called Morton. And they have houses there that are way cheaper, you know, than the houses that are over uh, on our side, you know. Like, everything is, uh, you know, everything's relative to where you go and the neighborhood, the school district, you know. It's like... Yeah. Then they go up too in some areas. Like when we bought our house 20 years ago, that's what it was. But right down, uh, 
<laughs> Rabbit Wolf says, man, I need me a Mrs. Wolf. <laughs> um, the house down the street from us, they just sold that house like three years ago for like a half a million dollars. I was like, yeah. Because the higher those houses sell around us, the higher our house goes. It's like, you know, it's unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> All right, brother. Have a good one, sir. Be good. Good luck tomorrow and Saturday. Yeah, I know you aren't. All right, brother. Take care, man.
<laughs> I think she's got the donuts going on. <clears throat> Hey, brother. Oh, cool. He's already cultivating over there. Nice. I like it. Let me grab this dirty tractor. Go pick up that other cultivator. take a look oh sorry let me see what we got so we'll do one field oat and let me just take a look here yeah so we'll do um one field oat and i guess canola check the fields and make sure they don't need anything soil comp growth oh, cool. nope we're still good Canadian Gamer, what is going on, brother? How are you this evening? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming and joining us. Hope you're doing fantastic.
All right, let's take a look. Wow, look at that, Jinx. We got uh, 2,307 liters of manure, 2,900 of slurry, and 659 of milk. It's not bad. What's up, Vulcan? I'm hanging in there, Canadian. I'm hanging in there, my brother. Good to see you. Yeah, it's not not bad, given that <laughs> we we just found out about him yesterday. <laughs> we could have had that production going on for like two other days. It's so weird, dragons playing farm sim, but I never know what that cat sometimes. Yo. Oh. Can you help me for a moment here? I don't want them to melt. Can you get them in the fridge real quick and then come back? Please. Appreciate it. Tell the stream I said they're butters. <laughs> Oh my. Shoot. Yeah, yeah, we could do oat and uh, we'll do oat and canola. Yes. <laughs> Alright, that's trash. Mm -hmm. well, my name's purple on uh, your screen. On mine, it's green. Thank you. Now come back. Okay. What was that, brother? Nice. That's the way you do it. Yep, and that that dude's cultivating's almost done too. Um I'm telling you again, Papa. If you can trash that <laughs> put that in the sink. This tall where you I know, right? And then come back. I'm here. Uh uh, sink. And then trash. Uh -huh. Got it. Got it. Yep. Thank you, dear. Watch your step. I don't want you to trip. All right. Not bad. You know, we got that harvest. We're still ninety thousand. We got the horses going. We got the cows going. We still got these two fields generating an income. We've got a couple different crop types in the, uh, in the, uh, we got wheat. We got a little bit of canola. We got almost 20 grand of soy. So, not too bad. We're hanging in there. <clears throat> Sure have, haven't we? We've done some good stuff with this old equipment. The other day, um, oh my goodness, I just, I forgot the guy's name. It was, um, we've raided the guy, 
maybe like two weeks ago. It was an older gentleman. And um, he was like, man, I saw you with that old equipment. And I, he was like, oh, there ain't no way. I wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> He's like, man, you guys are dedicated. I was like, yeah, well. Of course. That's right. Heck, I wish there was a mod we can go back and have oxen pulled his damn things. <laughs> See us sitting up on top of a thing going, yeah, <laughs> yeah, come on, boy. <laughs> Yeah. That dude's got maybe, maybe one more pass and he'll, he should be done. Let's see if he can get, might be just a little too wide, but we'll see here. Yeah, it's going to be a little too wide. It's all right. So they, um, there was this really cool map that uh, I told Ghost about two weeks ago. It was called Chellington Valley that they put on here. It was a new map about two weeks ago. Awesome. Picture this map that we're on, but like three times bigger. And with a few other things on the map. So, sound like awesome map. He downloaded it, and uh, I sent a Discord message to everybody that said they were going to try and go on his server, because he has a dedicated server that you can go on 24 hours a day. So, um, about, what was it, Monday? I think it was Monday. All of a sudden, it was taken off the mod hub, and it, I haven't seen it back on yet, so... For whatever reason, they pulled the uh, they pulled it, and uh, you know I don't know if it's coming back if you know there's problems with it or what. But I was so amped, you know, I was ready to play that map, and I downloaded it. It was almost one gig in size. It was like 958 megabytes. Man, it was huge, man. Absolutely huge. And then it was gone. So I don't know if they had major issues and the modders got to rework it. But I. Th but what's funny is I thought Stevo said that he got the map, which means he probably got it from a third party. Which, if that's the case, then it means. There wasn't anything wrong with the map. Just Giant didn't want it up there. Which would be kind of weird. Because. Why wouldn't they want it up? You know. So I don't know what to believe. You scared yourself. 
Not sure if that's going to help you. <laughs> I think I'm making it better only tonight. <laughs> I try to, you know. I don't know if that'll help you. Trying to think if the next harvest, if we should get field 33. Hmm, that's 118, huh? <clears throat> oh man. Ah. Oh, excuse me. I'm just flipping around here. No rabbit wolves running low notes. 
Nice. Bad Wolf is back. Very cool. These guys are almost done over here. With the two of them running now, they're, they're busting it up. Of course, they're probably going to bump into each other here. No worries. <laughs> oh man. Oh. All right, Jinx. Well, I think I'm going to get ready to call it quits on here. Plus, I know you got to, you'll be getting an early start tomorrow. So that's, uh, that'll be good. We'll see you. We'll see you sooner. All right, everybody. Well, look, I appreciate you guys coming out this evening. And, um, yeah, we only got the two people in here, so I'm, I'm not going to rate anybody. Um, but, yeah, I, I appreciate it. I hope uh, you guys have a great evening. And um, I will see you guys tomorrow at some point. And uh, y'all be good. Be safe. All right. Hang in there. Uh, you have a good one, Wolf. All right. Be good, everybody. This is crew, and I'm out. <laughs> that was good. I didn't even know she was going to do that until she started talking. I got to say it. I got to say it. <laughs> oh, my God. That was awesome.